Hello folks and welcome back to RimWorld on Absurdities. Hope you're all having a great day. We're going to get back into things here and we are just uh, recovering uh, in quotes. Legon has a couple of little minor burns from the Tesseron beam from, from this guy, the Tesseron. And uh, yeah, we, we picked up the, well, we got the Mechanator ship. We got the implant for, who did we put it into? I think it might have been actually Legon, Anadin, who? It was Anadin, right? <laughs> We're remembering things, actually. I mean, I'm reading them, but it, it's fine. Uh, yeah, let's just continue to move time forward. We now have a constructor bot, so that's pretty sweet. Yeah, constructoid, who should be doing some things. Now, we're going to have to research basic mech tech here pretty, pretty quickly. Uh, right, I still don't know how to read this this uh screen so let me find it okay basic mech tech yeah it's it's way up there uh but that's what we're gonna start on here i gotta hit the research button interesting okay fine so we're gonna start with that and uh i would i would love to be able to queue stuff up but not in the current version of that screen uh we did get a couple other mods installed one of them being uh we had a request to also show fahrenheit so I thought, why not? Even though, you know, everyone should get on board with Celsius. I'm a Celsius guy, but uh, it's fine. I'm from Canada. We do Fahrenheit and Celsius. So I get it. Now, <laughs> if we're baking food, it's in Fahrenheit. If we're, uh, most of the time anyways, gauging the temperature in our homes, it's Celsius. Um, there's a whole flow chart for kind of how Canada does its temperatures. So anyways, uh, long story short, I get it. It's about 80 Fahrenheit outside, 27 Celsius. And I think it's like minus four. Everything lines up perfectly. So, you know, next run is just going to be a minus four all the time playthrough. Shaking my head. It's That's not going to happen. But anyways, we have that. We have Halt to Stack back uh, and a couple of others. Nothing too groundbreaking. Just stuff we had before that uh, has been updated and re-added to the game. All right, let's move things along. Legon is doing stuff. Look, Constructoid making floors. Beautiful. Jihondo, of course, much faster, but it's it's handy having a helper anyways. Uh, what do we have here? Okay, so those are buttons, work mode, recharge mode, and of course, sadly, we, we don't really have anyone to do the research right now. We should also strip the prisoners. Yes, before I forget. All right, Jihondo, haul your stuff in there. She's going to give birth just about any time, isn't she? All right. I want you to strip the prisoners, please. No forced work, yes. Well, what about the other prisoner that you should strip? There you go. And you should haul the flag vest out so they don't have just armor laying around. There you want to put her shirt back on, that's fine, but we took the armor off of them, so that's great. We have ghoul starvation again. Maxim needs meat. Alright, well, let's go into our wildlife tab here, and there's some alpaca. Let's hunt them. Let's hunt the donkeys. And who was it that was doing the hunting? I have to check every time. It was Anadin, and he's at priority one, so he should go off and do that as soon as he wakes up, which I say now. You're going to wear a uh, flak vest. Okay. Yep. I'm okay with that. Especially considering you're going out to hunt and things could, in theory, attack you. Have a meal. We've got ten vegetarian meals. Nine vegetarian meals. Uh, so, I mean, we're okay on corn, so that's not a big deal. Maybe we should increase the number we have, though. Vegetarian fine meals up to 16. Carnivore, I think we'll just turn off and we'll use the meat only for fine meals and for feeding Maxim. Legon is doing stuff. Cleaning dirt. Oh. 
No. <laughs> I say no. We've turned that off. Okay, so expansion is off, though. Jihan is going for a walk. And Anardin is hunting on alpaca. Good. Good, that's what I wanted. He's got the pistol for hunting, but I mean, it is longer range, so... It's really not ideal. But hey, there we go. Meat. Meat's back on the menu, boys! And gals and non-binary pals. Yeah. Uh, it's no good. Oh my gosh, it's quite the fire. Okay, everybody wake up. We'll fight the fire. Thank you. Thank you. This is the problem with wooden walls. Everything burns. We've detected a hunting worksite controlled by the Flololololol tribe. It's a little ways away. And yeah, critical alert. Ghoul starvation. Uh, Elapsus, can you... What do you mean we're missing corpses? There's a corpse right there. Hello? Okay, well, he's gonna eat from the corpse, so that's okay. I don't care if he eats the whole thing. That's why we couldn't butcher with it, because he had a job queued on. Fair enough. He's really mowing down. Or is he just standing there? Now he's wandering. He'll be okay. Here we go. Now we can butcher it. And we get a royal tribute collector about to show up. Wonderful. Yes, just stand right in the line of fire. No problem. What could happen? You know? Accidental shootings. Uh, speaking of accidental shootings... Oh, I was really hoping... I mean, I don't want them to die so much as I just want Rhino Corpse. Okay, Rhino Revenge, run away. Just, just keep running. Yes, run through the Royal Tribute Collectors. They should finish off the Rhino, and then we can pick up Le Corpse. Yeah, about that, Rhino. Ah, uh, there it goes. Oh my gosh! It one-shot... Posnikus, a Janissary. And uh, the Empire is not super happy about that. Okay. <laughs> I don't mind. I mean, minus five. It'll it'll right itself in time. They don't look too upset about it. They're like, yeah, we better get that Rhino. Because uh, we're very sorry about what happened there. Okay, meanwhile, the donkey... Yeah, okay. We'll get, we'll get someone to pick that up. Legon is having a sleep. All right, fair enough, you sleep. Sleep, sweet prince. What we could do is harvest a bunch of stuff from Stumpy, who I believe we're not keeping. Yeah, maintain only. You're the pyro, incapable of firefighting. Banchetta's the one we're keeping. So Stumpy, is going to have a bunch of stuff harvested. Um, let's add some bills. We're going to take an eye. I think we'll skip on the nose, ear, jaw situation. We could take uh, right shoulder, left leg, right leg, uh, that's right, we can't take organs. That was part of a mod. Oh, no, we can. Never mind. 
We'll take a kidney. We'll take a lung. And maybe, maybe this arm will heal up enough in the meantime. Where's uh, Lapsus? You are shooting a few arrows? No, no, no. You are, you are operating on Stumpy. We should probably, oh yeah, thinking about this now. We need a, a combined infirmary slash prison area because uh, surgery is something we're gonna often do and I wanna have a hospital to store our medicine as well as obviously heal our people in. Okay, there's one. You're gonna, you're gonna do it again, right. Yes, you're gonna do it until you pass out, more or less. Two, three, now, while I'm thinking about it, uh, mediocre throne room, okay, fair enough, but you're not upset about taking organs, which is just the way I like it. I believe that's part of our ideology anyways. Beautiful. Beautiful. No! No, they died! No! Well, we got two legs, a shoulder and an eye, or an arm and an eye. So, uh, fair enough. So much for selling them on. Let's put that in mind, the whole prison hospital thing. Let's set something up. I think we might extend this building out. Uh, let's see. So it's 11 in the middle, so we'll go 12. Uh, we'll have to stop short there. How about there? Like so, and... Hmm. Infirmary, long infirmary with, yeah, with the prison attached right here. Do we want to have it accessed from the other side? No, from this side, so we can get at them with medicine and such. So let's have that queued. We'll get the walls in. Uh, probably, probably a good idea to put doors in it, I guess, you know. That's how we'll do it. How we'll do it. Words. Oh, is that a martial arts target? It is. And panchetta has gone berserk. Why? Uh, because of poor mood. The final straw was my organ was harvested. Yeah. Try and calm Pancetta down. Hopefully this works out. Nope, they just decided not to. Or it failed immediately. I don't really want to shoot you. And yet. Okay, Maxim, you're gonna go... Yeah, I think that's probably the best bet here. Just let Maxim handle it. Maxim rev revels, rev revels <laughs> in the violent things. He's got the regeneration too, right? So let's get a couple bruises. Uh, Lapsus is sleeping. No, I'm gonna capture them again. There we go. A little bit of action for Maxim. Move it along. Jihondo just, you know, calmly building a floor as they sleep nearby. Trade caravan is leaving. Goodbye. Getting more meat. Jihondo's in labor. Jihondo is about to give birth. Reminder, I've never had this happen in any of my playthroughs in RimWorld. This is the first time having a child born. So that's pretty cool. Uh, she's going to have contraction for a few hours. 
Before delivering a baby, the labor may go through several stages of different levels of difficulty and danger. To improve the baby's chances, gather a doctor and others to help with the birth. Select Jihondo and press gather for birth to start the procedure. Uh, gather for birth. We're gonna do Elapsis as the doctor. Like on an, uh, or a wait, what? No. Doctor is Elapsis. There we go. Anadin and Legon, the room cleanliness is not great, but uh, take take place at their bed. And childbirth has begun. So this could take some time. Anadin jokes about fighting crux with Legon. They're just like having a bro moment while the birthing's happen happening. Huh? Okay, let's speed it right up then. Andrew didn't like him chatted about practicing with saws. Oh man, I had this saw once. It like cut dead straight. It was amazing. Oh, that's that's neat. Every time I try and cut, it always goes off to the side. Listen, man, it's all in how you hold your wrist. Yeah. Meanwhile, Jihondo in labor. They chatted about kids games. I'm like so gonna beat your kid at Monopoly. Yeah, I don't know about that, man. I don't know about that. Like, I'm gonna teach him the strats, you know. Don't worry with Boardwalk, just go with the greens. You know, all the greens and the yellows. Uh, Jihondo's labor went from mild to debilitating. And they spoke about sports. <laughs> Again, just the, the situation. It's a very... Let's chat about sports. Oh, and about fighting robbers with Anadin again. First it was crooks, now it's robbers. And it is in the final sta stages. <laughs> Talked about training doves. <laughs> okay. All right. And we have a baby. Healthy childbirth. <laughs> Jihanu gave birth to a healthy baby. Uh, the birth total quality was 83%, determined by these factors. Age, plus 50% quality. Medicine skill, plus 21. Loved one present, plus 5%. Indoors, plus 5%. And 2 out of 5 bed health effects, plus 2% quality. The chance of a healthy birth at this quality level was 90%. The baby has been given the temporary name Baby Ghoul. You can change it until one day after birth. Name Baby. All right, give me one second there. Oh, I think, uh, I think Twisted Soul is an appropriate name for a baby. Let's go with that. All right, so uh, the baby's just being left on the floor, incapacitated, mental state, giggling. Sweet. And okay, we, we're definitely gonna need, well, everybody's on childcare, which I think is, is fine, except for the fact that Elapsis is really the best one for it. Um, Legon, you're going to be off of child caring. Jihondo, being the mother, like, try and keep them off of it, right? Anyways, they've got three skill, they got four skill. Lapsus has nine. Does, does anything need to happen with the baby? Everybody's hungry, it doesn't matter. Leave the baby on the floor, it's not going anywhere. <laughs> Take the safe location. Please. There we go. Baby's in a crib. Amazing. Panchette is getting... Getting patched up. Yeah, I should have checked Panchetta to see if they were... In bad shape, but... Um, oh, I guess we can give them back their leg and hand. I guess we'll wait until we recruit them. Which hopefully will be fairly soon. We could always counsel. Let's try counsel. Maybe Pancetta will feel better about having their organs harvested. Minus 53. Okay, successfully counseled, canceling the mood impact of minus 30. Wow, that's great. So that's like 70. Gosh, your mood's like 100 plus positives. And, uh, you know, like. 70 negatives almost 68 i think
We definitely need a better storage room than this. I don't know what I was thinking, really. Um, actually, it, it could be fine. We just need to build a whole bunch of... What are they? What, what are they? Shelves. Shelving. Furniture. Shelf. Uh, I think we'll get the floors finished up and then we'll go there. I'm going to pass some time and we'll find out what's going to happen. We're low on baby food. Oh, wait, hold on. Hold on a moment. Make baby food times four. Do until you have. Uh, let's make sure we have a dozen at a time. Elapsis, you're gonna, you're gonna make the baby food, please, real quick. At least a little bit of baby food. And then we're gonna have to switch to meals because we're out of meals too. Okay, baby food. Uh, oh, we made 40? Oh, it makes 10 at a time. Oh, that's cheap. Okay, that's fine. So just when we get low, we'll, we'll have another bill go off like that. All right, there we go. There's some meals. Beauty. And let's, let's butcher a little bit. She's going to need a break here. We've got the meats. Okay. There we go. That'll be fine. I love this. Jihondo is just like chilling on the throne. It's totally not theirs, but they're going to chill there anyways. Reading a handbook for surgery. You know what? I guess the the other thing is I actually have to set the owner to elapsis. Yeah, we'll see if that changes anything. Nope, just gonna chill. Alrighty. We should take a moment here to plan a line of defense. And so I think we'll run that across and selectively cancel out I think we'll just leave a space of two. Like so. I don't love this space for it, but this is going to be hopefully just a, a temporary line of defense. We'll open it up that far so that people have to come in a certain distance. It'll work for our shotguns. I'm thinking of we make a, a proper shooting gallery up here. But maybe this maybe this will work. Actually, longer term. We want to mine that vein out, but we'll start there. And I mean, it's going to take a little while for this to get built because people are just busy. And we want barricades there. You know what? Let's go double barricade up like that. What? What's the worst that could happen? Cancel that. We just get double chance to to block shots with it. Yeah, that doesn't sound bad. So that'll be the temporary solution. We'll get rid of that. We don't want them to have cover if they choose to go in and hide there. Although, honestly, if as long as they're not charging us, that's not the worst either. So yeah, hopefully Jihondo makes a quick recovery. Uh, lactating. Oh my gosh. She, yep, they thought of everything. Uh, no slaves in colony. Again, not too worried about that. How do we how do we feel about the baby being born? Nothing. Nobody. Upset uh, about the awful bedroom. Legon, opinion of your wife. Twisted soul was born healthy. Plus eight. Jihondo. Minor passion for my work. Twisted Soul was born healthy. Yeah, just a small mood buff. You'd think that they would have a really quite a large one for a few days. Until, you know, just normalcy sets in, I guess. But plus eight is is decent. Jihondo's researching. Oh no. No, you're breastfeeding. Okay. You're just using the convenient chair. That's fine. Oh my god, look at the... 
Okay, that's cute. That's cute. Wonderful. Meanwhile, the robot still still building things. Well done, robot. Cool. Well, it's going to run out of energy soon, and we have nowhere to recharge it, so... So be it. Labs is doing some recruiting here, I believe. Come on, big jump. And it has a work frenzy. Cool. Okay, resistance is coming down sort of slowly. 18.3 to 16.8. So that's going to take... Um, yeah, a lot. It's going to take a lot. A few days. Fire. Is that really part of the home zone? I guess it was because I expanded it to fight a fire. Uh, we should put it in. There's no rain right now. Hondo's back to work. That's cool. Is no one going to fight the fire? Honda will. There we go. Everybody's on it. Working together. Cool. Except Maxon. He's just chilling, staring at a chair. Good thing Honda's back on the job. Wow, she's so fast. could haul this clothing one of these days. My gosh. Hang on. Haul the flak pants. There we go. Cleaning up after the raids. Flak vest is in poor shape. I don't think they get tattered, though. I think you can wear them down to a nub. Could be wrong about that. Let me know in a comment if I am. Deterioration. Yeah, look at this. More, more just... We so need a hauler. So much in poor shape. Pancetta, be easier to recruit. Feeling pretty good, even though there's body parts laying around. We can all that too. There we are. Looks like we need another light in here. Just a regular old wall lamp. Stick it right there. Be interesting to know effectively what skill level the constructoid works at. Uh, more shamblers, four of them, in fact. Is that right? Yep, four of them. Okay, Anadin and Legon. We're gonna we're gonna shoot them again. They're in a really inconvenient spot, aren't they? Again. You know what? I changed my mind. We're going to leave these ones in peace. We get enough going on right now. Oh, but there is a raid from the Horax cultists. There are four of them. And you have steel mace. There's a funky looking steel mace, steel knife, steel knife, steel axe. Okay, is it just... I mean, I shouldn't... I shouldn't say, is it just four of you, but is it? Oh no, they intend to use a psychic ritual to summon hideous flesh beasts to attack us. They might perform their ritual multiple times. You need to go stop them. Just what I was thinking. Okay, 
everybody grab a gun unless you're Maxim and let's get going oh they're beginning a ritual I don't think we're gonna get there in time to stop it oh four hours maybe we will okay move faster so Maxim we're gonna send right in Everybody else will gather behind for firepower purposes. You're you're doing the ritual. You're doing the ritual. They're all doing the ritual. Okay, so disrupt as many of them as we can. Oh, they they have decided to get involved right away. Headshot. Beautiful. Slow him down. Nice. One down. Poor Maxim is really getting messed up, though. No! Maxim is dead! No! You were so good with your... Gould regeneration. Oh man. He yeah, he lost a lot. Gosh, they are butchers. Okay. Seriously though. Uh who has who has melee? Melee three. Melee four. Okay, really? Okay. We're on him. Ooh. Oh boy. And you are doing what? You're still doing it? Okay. Let's have a look at the state of our people here. You're dead in seven hours. You're dead in 24 hours. Tenji Hondo. Who's got the gun? You got you got the long range gun. So we'll get, long range. get their attention. Okay, we're gonna go. Oh no, 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 no. Shoot, shoot him. No. Okay, no immediate danger. Get back in the fight. Yes. The cultists are attacking. Yeah. <laughs> Get wrecked, cultists. All right. Everybody go home. Poor Maxim. Man. All right. Well, there's nothing for it. We're just going to have to get another ghoul in our lives. Of course, there's four down. No, those are shamblers. Never mind. They're not ghouls. Wells. Yeah. You do. You guys all naked? They're naked cultists. Either that or all their... I could have swear they were wearing something. Maybe they had acidifiers on them. Who knows? That's a normal knife. That's a normal knife. That's a normal axe. That's Maxim. Never mind. Steel mace. There we go. Well, that's our first time fighting off one of those. That was interesting. Afraid that's going to be it for this episode. Hope you're all doing well, and thank you for watching. Uh, I will see you in the next one. Yeah, I feel like I need to say more, but I really don't. Okay.
Bye for now.